So today is Thursday and I am at Publix getting the supplies for my three day grapefruit detox. Yes, I'm super excited. Oh, I'm trying to mentally prepare my mind to make sure so that I'm successful. It's around 12 o'clock and I feel like my mind is playing with me a little bit because this will be around the time that I eat. I feel a little slight headache where it's trying to be like eat, eat, but I'm not like, not like dying or anything. So it's going good soon. I still got two more hours before I drink my grapefruit. So, just doing a quick check-in. Everything's going good. I feel pretty good. Alright, so it is now 2 o'clock. Um, I really just have a headache. I realize that that's usually what happens when I get hungry. I get this headache, um, but I don't really feel hungry. So, I'm going to do my grapefruit. So, here's all the juice looks. A little chunky um i put like two little pieces of orange in there and i can really i really feel like it saved it i didn't put a whole orange just a little something to get your girl through because <laughs> um yeah it's chunky but um it's not bad it's not bad and when it first hit my tongue i was happy okay so uh, we'll be back at four. Okay, so I don't like it. And it makes me not want to drink it. Like, I, I really feel like I'd rather eat nothing. But I'm just going to drink it slow. Maybe that will help it. Um, mm -hmm. Key loves it. Mm -hmm. I'm blogging. Um, Key loves it. Right? Yeah. And she's going to help me drink this one. But, yeah. It's not really my favorite. Maybe I might add a little more orange just just to get through because I, I got I, I got a long way to go. I want to go too. So it's seven o'clock and I was supposed to eat I think one or two grapefruits at six, but I it took me an hour to finish it at four thirty. I'm behind schedule just because I don't like it. Um I don't like it. And I'm a little angry about it. And if you see my cheeks, that's how I feel on the inside. That's that's how I feel right now. So, yeah. Uh, I'm a little angry about it. Because I feel like... I feel like it's not even that I'm hungry. It's really my mind. And I just feel like, damn. Like, is my, is my mind that weak? Like, am I really that much of a foodie that i really just can't close my mouth for for a day i'm not eating i'm not eating because i know how i am i know that I'm if i disappointed like around. i couldn't make it so i'm just gonna go for it but i did hold on key i did i didn't realize i did but then i didn't realize it was mother's day on sunday and then my cousin called and invited everyone out to dinner so I'm probably gonna cut it on Sunday afternoon instead of doing it all the way through Sunday. So my goal is to make it today and tomorrow, which is <laughs> difficult enough. So, um, but yeah, I'm, I'm gonna eat on Mother's Day. Um, I didn't really think this totally way through, but I didn't wanna just throw the whole thing away. So I'm gonna still, you know, try to commit to it as much as I can. But yeah, I'm about to go in here and eat these grapefruits and um, yeah, probably lay down and watch some TV or get my mind off of it because this is this is ridiculous. Okay, so eating them is way better than drinking them. I don't know why y'all didn't tell me that to begin with, but my husband's hating on me. But anyway, I feel I feel better. I'm eating one. I'm about to cut me up another one, and yeah. We are on day two, and as you can see, I'm feeling like the queen that I am because I made it through day one when I really, really, really wanted to give up, and I was really angry yesterday, and today I feel much better. Like, uh, I feel like a little something like I could eat, but it's not 
so bad and also I got on the scale and I was four pounds down which I know isn't a real four pounds but um it was just good to see so yes it's about 11 30 I have to wait till two to drink my first grapefruit and I'm feeling okay so it's two o'clock and um I'm feeling much better today guys I'm shocked that I didn't eat anything yesterday and um it's two o'clock the next day and I feel much better. I feel really proud of myself about yesterday. Um, that four pounds on the scale definitely helped um, push me to finish. Um, so we have here a great food for today. So I made some changes today. Um, I realized I was using room temperature water to make it, which was making it even harder to drink. Um, so I made it cold water and I kept the grapefruits in the, um, in the refrigerator. Uh, I also was intentional on how I cut it. I kind of cut some of the stringy stuff that was getting caught in my mouth and making me gag. I kind of cut that off ahead of time. So, um, that's another thing that I did a little different today. Um, I haven't had an excessive amount of, um, bowel movements. Um, I just did my regular thing, um, but I did notice the grapefruit in there. Like the shreds coming out um lots and lots of peeing like heavy amounts of peeing um and yeah i i feel way better today is that with kimani as you can see in the video she did drink a lot of grapefruit juice yesterday and she did have three bowel movements uh she usually has two so you know it's an extra one but you know she's she's been vegan since birth and she didn't have the digestive you know traumas that I have so I can definitely see it cleaning her out more but um like I said uh as far as you know feeling flushed I definitely feel that through you know the excessive peeing that I did so this is the one for today much better guys make sure you use cold water and keep the um the fruits in the refrigerator much much better i guess that's what they say you live and you learn 44 and i drank it at two you seen how it was but then i took my daughter to space cadets because she wanted to go and i missed four o'clock and now it's 5 44 and i still haven't had anything i literally walked on in the house and collapsed on the bed because i'm like so hungry i noticed that during the daytime, in the morning, I'm fine. But then at nighttime, that's when it starts getting crazy. So I'm going to prepare myself a small salad just from to stop from passing out. But I don't want to blow it. So I'm just going to stick to a small salad and then keep going. So I ate a small salad, which you've seen the picture of. Super small and just that little bit of food, like gave me back life um and i realized with this with this detox you really can't do anything yesterday i was able to maintain because i was sitting on the couch i wasn't doing anything like i was literally home today i had things to do i had to meet with my um sisters from the goddess circle then i take brianna work then i took kimani to space cadets it was just too much you can't do anything so that's why I'm giving myself a little grace, um, not feeling too bad about the salad because if I was at home, I would have been able to keep going. But I'm going right back at eight with my grapefruit and I'm shutting it down. So, and then we're right back at it tomorrow. For so today is day three and I feel pretty good. But you guys know I feel good in the morning and I start getting angry at night. Uh, I haven't had any grapefruit, I just had water. And I am... At the restaurant with my family, safaris. Um, and yeah, I'm, I don't really see anything I want. But I'm gonna see if I'm gonna end it here or if I'm gonna keep going. I haven't made my decision. Um, I ended up having a small salad and some stir fried veggies. So. <laughs> so that is the end. Um, I'm super proud of myself because I was starving and I'm gonna try this again and I feel like for my first time for my first detox I did very well um what baby okay and um yeah I definitely um when I got on the scale this morning I was down another pound so I lost five pounds total 
Um, and that is the conclusion of this grapefruit detox cleanse. Um, hope everyone enjoyed the video. So it's Monday and I'm leaving the gym. Um, when I got on the scale this morning, I put back one pound, I guess because I ate yesterday. So that just showed me a few things about how my body works um, when it comes to fasting and eating. But I really feel like I gained some valuable lessons from this. Um, I feel very refreshed. I feel like I'm going to um, actually pick up intermittent fasting. Um, where you eat from 12 to 8 so i'm about to start with juice i think i'm about to start i'm about to make a lot of changes like that um that detox really did something to me so i just want to do a last little update um thanks for everyone who watched um this was my first video i've ever posted on my youtube channel so thank you guys so much and peace and love <laughs>